metallic watercolors to create an autumn flower arrangement. And today we're gonna learn some techniques of blending. My goal is to allow the autumn colors to flow into themselves. As I begin creating my pretty petals, I leave space open for the other colors. The beauty of watercolor is the fact that they naturally flow into themselves. And as you can see, I'm bringing in some orange tones, as well as I'll also be bringing in yellow. The beauty about the watercolors also is that when it dries, it often has beautiful crisp little edges where the color pulls to them, giving a fine definition. Again, once that it's dried, I stipple the yellow for a very delicate center of the flower facing the sun in the autumn season. Again, with my second autumn flower, I allow the white to remain so that my other colors can start to blend and make a very nice variegated soft palette in these petals. Water really assists the colors to blend. And I do leave some open spaces between them. And to give a little more light petals below. Just give a little fuller look to this flower to this as well but just a hint I don't want to detract from the frontal petals and let's stipple the top and give it a nice little edge that way as well these are metallic watercolors which give a really pretty glisten in the sun and for these leaves, I just want to touch it up again, give it a little overlay, that crimson reddish color that I've put in there. If you ever find that it's too dark, you want to bring in a little light, you can actually do this with your paintbrush by wiping off your paintbrush and dragging it in and the paintbrush will actually soak it up like it has here. So sometimes you can do the reverse. And for my pretty stems, I just want to make two complementary semi-circular shapes so that they face each other in this little dual flower arrangement that I'm making. I want the petals and the stem to be light and a complement to these autumn flowers. I don't want them to detract too much. And always feel free to take your subject matter off of your surface of your paper here allowing that leaf to just float, you know float off that edge and then the other leaf off of the stem is full that you can see I'm just playing with the water and giving it a little fullness Just a few little darker elements to the pretty little 
dots above little stamen that really support the golden pollen. And the sun catches these autumn colors. The metallics really make them shine. You can see the delicate nature and the leaves off of the stems. Thanks so much for coming along with me today as we paint a few flowers for the autumn season, the harvest season. I am always wishing you happy watercolor creations. <laughs>